Dr. Bronner's 18-in-1 Hemp Tea Tree Pure Castile Soap. Certified fair trade made with organic oils. Ingredients are water, organic coconut oil, potassium hydroxide, organic palm kernel oil, organic olive oil, tea tree extract, organic hemp oil, organic jojoba oil, citric acid, and tocopherol. Tosoferol? Oh, welcome to Katie Narnia, where I vlog from the middle of nowhere, Alabama. Hey, y'all. Teach the moral ABC that unites all mankind free. Instantly, six billion strong, and we are all one. Listen, children, eternal father, eternally one. From Jesus' manual of discipline, based on Halil's moral ABC, the army of principles, one God faith, unites the human race. As found, 1948, by Mohammed's Arabs, in Israel Azine scrolls, English by soap maker Bronner. Under one eternal father, I must teach friend and enemy the full truth moral ABC to unite all mankind free in one God faith. To get it done, a beast can only listen to its friend. A human being must teach love his enemy or that being is not yet human. A shark can only love its friend. Lacking frontal lobes, it must avoid fear, smear, hate, slander, dominate, dictate, distort, destroy anything it does not know, understand, or disagrees with. That's a shark. But a human being possessing the kingdom of God's law, the Essene moral ABC within his frontal lobes, works hard to teach friend and enemy the moral ABC. Otherwise, that being is not yet human. A human being is a constructive working scientist who knows, loves, follows, teaches full truth, God's law, to all of God's children, friend and enemy. Otherwise, that being is not yet human. Exceptions? None! The moment any being follows, tolerates, or teaches earthen half-gods or half-truisms, that moment he becomes an intolerant beast. Potentially ten times more dangerous, dangerous and destructive, destructive than any ordinary shark, snake, rat, or panther. We must teach love our enemy or perish. Beast! teach only their friends. But after 2,000 years, it never got done. The godless beasts still disapproved. Result, these tremendous 13 words never got printed because the brilliant 48-year-young Rabbi Liebman's book was distorted after he dropped dead. Diagnosis, sudden heart attack. Oh. Exactly as suffered by Rabbi Jesus, Spinoza, Thomas Paine, Samuel Friedman, Steiner Prague, and Rabbi Bank. Six and 66 million sudden heart attacks. Murders caused by us godless intolerant beasts. He who risks his life teaching friend and enemy, the moral ABC uniting all mankind free, wins eternal life. He who does less than that, perishes by half true strife. I am the son of God and so are you. I am the manifestation of God's eternal law and so are you. I have learned great wonders. You shall learn greater wonders. I have done good work. You shall do better work. I have not come to change God's law, but we each came to find, follow, fulfill, print, protect, practice, preach, teach, and enjoy it. Therefore, Build you first the kingdom of God's eternal law within you. That is, memorize the Essene moral ABC of the free. All one faith in one God state. To never yield to half true hate. And everything you need shall be added unto you. Search and you shall find. Knock. And it shall be opened. So and you shall reap. Work hard and you shall create. Speak up. Don't be afraid and you shall receive. But remember, only those enjoy eternal life in our all-embracing Father's kingdom that had the courage to teach friend and enemy the moral ABC to unite all free. Hello everyone. I 
just wanted to come back and say that I hope that I didn't offend anybody. If you're a Christian and you felt like I was mocking the Christian faith, please know that that's not what I was doing. I was actually just trying to get across how extreme a bottle of soap is. It's odd to print all of those things, including the things about the dragons and the panthers and the not being human and all of those things on a bottle of soap. I love Dr. Bronner's. I only use Dr. Bronner's. I have the tea tree and the almond soap. I used to use the peppermint one. That soap is amazing. I just wanted to say that I wasn't trying to offend anybody and it's just a funny thing to put on a bottle of soap. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> All right, love you guys. Have the best day ever. Bye. Oh yeah, thanks so much for watching. And as always, have yourselves a pleasant morning, day, afternoon, evening, night, forever. Goodbye. <laughs>